Vape Girl Review and today we're going to talk about Double Comma Vapes. Five flavors for you that I am going to try and describe to you and I've got to tell you one of these flavors is topped at my all-time favorite flavor I've ever tried hands down. It's I call it a miracle flavor. I reached out to them asking them what the heck they put in it because it's absolutely delicious. But I'm going to start with the Hot Wheels. The Hot Wheels is your PB&J with grape jelly and I'm going to take a vape for you. It is in here. This is all I have left. Literally, I vaped the entire bottle gone. So focus on it. It won't. But anyways, look. It's gone. Gone because I put it down. It is so good. Okay, so I'm going to take a vape for you and describe it. Okay, so like I said, I vaped this flavor pretty much gone. 60 mils of it just out the door. It is a mildly sweet flavor. It has notes of a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, but it has those grape undertones as well. It is a medium base flavor. It is not too strong and it is definitely not too sweet. I, I would categorize it as a mildly sweet flavor. However, the flavor itself is a medium, if that makes sense. There is definitely flavor in this that's not short of flavor and I don't think that if you're a PB&J with grape jelly lover that you're going to be disappointed. I recommend this flavor. I love it and as you know I vaped the whole thing on so of course I loved it. Obviously if it was something that I didn't think that was amazing I wouldn't have put it down so quickly. I definitely recommend this to you who love PB&J fl flavors with a little bit of grape in it. So yeah. That is the Hot Wheels from Double Comma Vapes. All right, so we're gonna move along. I am going to move along to one that I wasn't a big fan of, and that is going to be your nitrous oxide, which is gonna be a lemon-infused energy drink. And here, you guys know me very well. You guys know that I'm not a lemon fan, and I'm also not an energy drink fan. I vaped this, and it's really not for me. However, with that being said, for those who love the lemon energy drink flavors, the Mountain Dewish flavors, whatever, those people I've seen on their page saying, I love the nitrous oxide. But again, like for me, I'm not even gonna put it on my cotton because it'll be hard for me to get it off. It's not something that I personally would pick, but for you energy drink, you but, sorry, but for you energy drink lovers, it is going to be one you might want to check out because I've seen positive feedback from those who like that flavor profile. Personally for me, it's not for me. So, you know, it's, it's going to be subjective. Everything is subjective, guys. So if you love lemon type energy drinks, if you like those Mountain Dew energized drinks or whatever, and Red Bull or whatever, I'm not sure. I don't really drink them because I don't like them. So it makes sense that I wouldn't like this. You want to check this flavor out. Okay, so we're going to move along. Their macchiato flavor, which is like an iced caramel uh, macchiato. Um, it has a name to it. I can't pronounce it, so I'm going to look stupid. It's um, Mercilego. <laughs> I don't know, but this is actually, I forced myself to stop vaping this flavor. This flavor is amazing. I adore it. I completely recommend it. It is, um, it has an amazing ice flavor to it. Um, it's got your caramel macchiato iced coffee flavor. Nailed. It is nailed. Dead on. I actually reached out to them and I asked them, what the heck did you put in this? Why do I really taste ice? And they told me they actually have an ice flavoring in there. I've got to tell you, I've had four other people try this flavor because I had to know if they loved it as much as me and all of us. All of us agree that it is spot on for a caramel ice macchiato caramel iced coffee, whatever you call it. It has the ice in it, literally the ice in it. Totally one I recommend, totally one that I have to tell you to go get. Um, this is my new favorite flavor of all time. Yes, I said of all time, period, all time. This has reached number one status. Number one, I will buy this, I need this, and I need to have it frequently. So yeah, you need to check them out very delicious, very yummy. I'm gonna take a vape for you now, sorry. <laughs> I got carried away talking about it, but here we go.
Again, this is another medium flavor. It's got the sweet notes in there. It is not too strong, but that ice note, that ice really comes in and you just taste it at, on the exhale. And when it's done, you really feel like you literally took a sip, drank your iced caramel coffee thing and put it down and that is still in your mouth like you sucked on some ice cubes. It is amazing. It does not have a menthol taste to it, guys. It is straight up pure just ice cube with your caramel coffee flavor. It is amazing and I'm gonna stop talking about it because I can go on because I really love this flavor. It is my number one. Number one, A plus, exceptional, exceeds expectations, exceeds any expectation I would have had of it. I was amazed and blown away. Check out the, it's called Murcielago. <laughs> so stupid. Oh, here, let's see if I can get you to look at it. All right, guys, seriously, go check that out. A plus for me. Um, so far, the uh, Hot Wheels and this macchiato flavor are A pluses. I'm not going to grade the lemon energy drink because it's not fair because I personally don't like lemon drinks or energy drinks or anything lemon or anything energy. I won't buy Red Bull. I'm not one of those people. Um, I'd rather have a Mountain Dew pure and simple so that's why I'm not going to grade that one. If I were to grade it for my personal reference, um, I mean it tastes like an energy drink so I'd meet them in the middle with a B but for me it's not something I'd pick up. But with that being said, you guys might like it. Okay so we're going to move along. Okay guys so we're moving on to the double clutch crunch. Say that five times fast. Double clutch crunch, double clutch crunch, crunch, double clutch. Bleh. I can't say that. This is going to be your peanut butter. It says Peanut butter crunch cereal with bananas, guys. So I'm gonna put this on and take a vape for you. All right. Okay, so right off the bat, I'm gonna say the banana flavor is more mild. It is definitely not overpowering, definitely not overwhelming. So if you're looking for a peanut butter cereal type flavor that has bananas in it, this is gonna be for you. This is actually surprising for me that I really like this. As you can see, I had to stop vaping all of the majority of these, other than the nitrous oxide. I had to stop myself vaping them because I would have been done with them way before the review so I had to kind of put them on the shelf put them away um, this has your peanut butter taste with which is more medium the medium peanut butter cereal it really does nail peanut butter cereal but then you've got that mild banana taste coming through it's very light it's not in your face banana and that's I think why it works so well um, I really like this flavor a lot guys Yeah, this flavor is more medium. It's more medium sweet, um, but it's a really good flavor all around and another one I can highly recommend. And So if you like peanut butter and you like banana, and shoot, if you ever mix them together, this is gonna be the one, the double clutch crunch. Double clutch crunch, double clutch crunch. Go double clutch, <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do anything five times fast, period. That's just not how my brain works. I need to slow it down. Even though it seems I talk fast, I still need to slow things down or else I get all jumbled. Even in regular conversation, I'm like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> All right. Yes, definitely recommend this one. Okay, so we're going to move along. We're going to try this Contash Crumble. It's a peach crumble. So let's give it a whirl. Let me get it on my cotton and we'll take a vape. Smells good. It smells really good and this is my first time trying it, so let's give it a whirl. Okay, so this is a medium flavor. I definitely taste the peach coming through, but it's not very sweet, so it's more of a mild sweetness again. Um, it's different. It's very different. Let me take another vape.
Okay, so this is a good flavor. It's not my favorite of all their flavors. Um, I definitely taste the peach coming through and honestly it's just more like it tastes more to me just a mild peach flavor so maybe the crumbles for dessert I'm not real positive on that one um, but for me it's more just for you guys who like peaches but don't want that ultra sweet flavor this flavor is gonna get a B from me I don't love it but I definitely don't hate it um, I do definitely taste the peaches and I think that it's nice that it's not an overly sweet peach flavor because sometimes when you get peach flavors they can just be like whoa that's so sweet like they overcompensate this is more of a simplistic peach flavor to me yeah just a more simplistic peach maybe like a peach cobbler more on the mild sweet side so yeah it's a good flavor those of you who are searching for a mildly sweet peach flavor to make so my husband just totally interrupted us to tell me that there's a Pikachu at my house which I already know that because duh I caught it already like five minutes ago and yes I do play Pokemon Go but anyways moving along we're going to move along from that to we're gonna move along to the Skyline Fuel, which is a cool grape drink. So I'm anxious to try this one, a cool grape drink. Let me get this off of here and get this on. Okay, so Skyline Fuel is going on at the moment, and I really hope I don't set off my smoke detectors because it's looking like I'm fogging up this room. <laughs> Ooh, it does smell like grape Kool-Aid. Mmm, that smells good, actually, really good. Okay, let's try this Skyline Fuel. Okay, this one's more sweet. This is a sweet grape flavor. I do taste the grape Kool-Aid. Okay, this is for you Kool-Aid lovers. If you like grape Kool-Aid, then you're gonna like this Skyline Fuel. It definitely tastes like it's straight grape Kool-Aid. So it's very sweet. It's more of a, this one's more of a medium stronger flavor. And the sweetness is definitely more medium. It's got more sweetness than the other ones that I've tried. So if you're wanting a sweet grape Kool-Aid, that's gonna be this Skyline Fuel. This is a really good flavor. I'm gonna give this one an A. I really like it. Um, it's not my favorite of theirs. Like I said, I love that ice caramel uh, coffee flavor. That's the bomb.com. Love it, love it. And I'm gonna have to get that in like liters, <laughs> gallons by the gallons. Well, hey, will you guys send it to me by the gallons? Cause that would be great. But anyways, yeah, this is a very sweet, cool grape drink. I think it tastes like grape Kool-Aid, straight up freshly mixed right out of the refrigerator. If it was still warm because it's a vape <laughs> but yeah it's very good love this flavor guys love double comma vapes I really think that they're great um, they mix their stuff really well they put a lot of time into it and they're really delicious and they come highly recommended by me I personally would endorse them and I think that they're one of the better e-liquid flavors, uh, e-liquid makers that I have ever tried. So yeah, go check them out. If you guys decide to order, use VGR10. It will save you 10% off. And I do believe it's all free shipping. So yeah, um, what are you waiting for? Go get you some of that iced uh, caramel coffee drink or go get you some of that um, Hot Wheels, which is your PB&J with grape jelly because that, those two you know they would have been gone a lot sooner if I didn't have to practice restraint which is very hard for me to do especially with e-liquid you guys know that but yeah I'm gonna take another read for this this is this is good this kool-aid this grape kool-aid is very good as well take it in baby take it in yummy all right guys Yes, VGR10 saves you 10% off. Don't forget to go over there and try it because, like I said, they're among my favorite. I love them. All right, I'm going to go now. Don't forget to like this video and share it as well as subscribe to my channel, guys. I truly appreciate it, and I do notice, and I want to thank all of you who have subscribed to me. That makes me happy, and you bring a smile to my face every time I see a new subscriber. I 
really appreciate you guys. And don't forget to check out Double Comma Vapes. Highly recommended. I love them. BGR 10 will save you 10% off. All right, guys, I'm going to go. I'll check you later.